I like to call people up in the middle of the night. You ought to try it. It's a lot of fun. <laughs> Wake up at 4, 4.30 in the morning, pick up that phone, call anybody, even a stranger. Just close your eyes and dial a number. <laughs> hey, how you doing? Yeah, you've got to get up and go to the bathroom. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> that joke gets funnier as you get older. You ever get up in the middle of the night to go to the bathroom, see yourself in the mirror, scare the heck out of yourself? <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! I'm fat. <laughs> I am, look at that. You know what it is, my kitchen is in the center of the house. Every time I walk from room to room, I've got to walk through the kitchen, and those Keebler cookie elves, they call me. <laughs> and in my house, those elves, they're not Irish, they're Italian. They're like, hey, you, hey, you, get over here. Get a, take a couple of cookies, will you? I can't. I can't have any cookies. I've got, I've got to get rid of this thing. Forget about this thing. In fact, take the whole bag, get yourself a glass of milk, enjoy yourself. I can't. I can't. I promised my wife I'd get rid of this. Your wife? Your wife's already been here three times today. <laughs> I don't know what this means. Any Italians out there? I'm the only one. We talk with our hands. All the Italians talk with their hands. I have an uncle in Italy, lost both arms. He can't talk. <laughs> you've been sitting in a parking lot, all of a sudden a car next to you starts to pull back. You think you're moving, see a slam on your brakes? Yeah. Am I the only one? <laughs> Remember when you were a kid, you used to talk in the window fans? <laughs> your mom would always say the same thing. Your voice will stay like that. <laughs> I remember when I was a kid, my dad would throw me up in the air and walk away. I, I remember one Christmas, all my dad bought me for Christmas was a slinky, a lousy, stinking slinky. We lived in a one-story house. We had no stairs. <laughs> but we didn't have good toys when I was a kid. We had crummy toys. Anybody, anybody about my age? Anybody up about my age? 28? Anybody 28? <laughs> Who can remember when a slinky was a major toy? <laughs> That's all we had. Slinky, silly putty, super ball. Who's ever played with a super ball? You play with it once, <laughs> gone forever. <laughs> Uno. You gonna play Uno? You think maybe down in Mexico there's a game called One? <laughs> One. One. It'd be a lot of fun unless you're playing with a guy named Juan. <laughs> Juan, si, sí. no Juan, Juan. Si, sí, no Juan, 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 no Juan, Juan. Let's play Monopoly. And pick up sticks. Who invented pick up sticks? Pick them up. Could you imagine getting a child off an Xbox or a PlayStation in today's world? to play pick-up sticks. <laughs> son, come over here with your dad and play pick-up sticks. It's a lot of fun. You know what we're gonna do, son? We're gonna take these sticks, we're gonna drop them. Then we're gonna pick them up. <laughs> and they're looking at me, Dad, you like stupid? I had no friends growing up, I had no friends at all. I remember one year my parents bought me just one walkie-talkie. <laughs> <laughs> Can you hear me now? <laughs> I used to play the piano in the high school marching band. <laughs> guys, wait up! My time's up. You guys have been wonderful. Thank you so much for coming. Out. Hey, did you know that Drybar has their own app? In fact, you can download it right now as I speak so you can watch my whole special. It's right here, Drybar app.